are you frustrated with the error on your Google Pixel? Your device is corrupt, it can't be trusted and may not work properly. Hi everyone, Imran here with another video and in today's video I will show you step by step instruction on how to fix this error with any Google Pixel model. It can be the latest Google Pixel 7 Pro, 7, Pixel 6 Pro, Pixel 5a, Pixel 5 and other older models. So let's get started on how to fix this error. When you turn on your phone, you will get this error. Your device is corrupt. It can be trusted and may not work properly. Now when I press the power button to continue. Now again press the power button. Now the phone will remain stuck on the Google logo. And it won't boot. As you can see. Now what you need to do is turn off the phone by pressing the power button for 10 to 15 seconds if it does not work then hold the power plus volume up keys as you can see and hold these two keys for at least 10 to 15 seconds this will turn off the phone now as you can see the phone is turned off now you need to hold the power plus volume down keys to boot the phone into pass boot mode. Now the phone is in pass boot mode. Now you need to connect your phone to PC using a USB cable. Now on your phone open the browser and type flash.android.com Click on allow ADB access Now here you need to select your device My device is Google Pixel 7 I selected it as you can see it says connected Now here it will show you all the Android builds available for your device The developer preview is for developers and mostly these are not stable so we need to install a stable version click on back to public and click on default you can choose option to lock the bootloader wipe device data and then select the install build now here it will show you the build number and giving you a warning that it will erase all data on your device and please do not disconnect your device while it download the firmware for your device click on confirm accept the license terms and condition now it will start preparing your device and now downloading the software which is the latest android 13 Now it will take some time depending on your download speed. Please do not close this step otherwise you will have to restart from the start. Now once the download is complete it will start installing the software and your device will reboot into fast boot mode again. You don't have to do anything unless you are instructed to do. Now again the flashing can take from 5 to 10 minutes.
producing these tutorials takes a lot of efforts and time for encouragement please like this video and subscribe to our channel now during the software installation your device might stuck on the same error so you need to click on the reselect device and press the power button on your phone to restart your phone now pc will recognize your device again as you can see select the device pixel 7 and click on the connect now it will resume the software installation It is almost done. Finally, it will ask you to log the bootloader. Is if you remember in the beginning of this video, we selected the option to log the bootloader, and also wipe data option was also there. So if you have selected that option, then it will now ask you to log the bootloader. Click on Start and pick up your device and select the log the bootloader option using volume up key and select it using power key once done click on the done button and your phone will restart again Congratulations, you have successfully fixed the error your device is corrupt. Now you need to set up your phone like you would normally do. Connect to a Wi-Fi network and then set up your device. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this.